Sanction is given unto those who fight because they have been wronged, and Allah is indeed able to give them victory. Those who have been driven from their homes unjustly only because they said, Our Lord is Allah. For had it not been for Allah's repelling some men by means of others, cloisters and churches and oratories and mosques wherein the name of Allah is oft mentioned would assuredly have been pulled down. Verily, Allah helpeth one who helpeth him. Lo, Allah is strong, almighty. Those who, if we give them power in the land, establish worship and pay the poor due, and enjoin kindness and forbid iniquity, and Allah's is the sequel of events. If they deny thee, Muhammad, even so the folk of Noah and the tribes of Ad and Thamud before thee denied our messengers, and the folk of Abraham and the folk of Lot, and the dwellers in Midian, and Moses was denied, but I indulged the disbelievers a long while, then I seized them, and how terrible was my abhorrence. How many a township have we destroyed while it was sinful, so that it lieth to this day in ruins, and how many a deserted well and lofty tower. Have they not traveled in the land, and have they hearts wherewith to feel, and ears wherewith to hear? For indeed it is not the eyes that grow blind, but it is the hearts which are within the bosoms that grow blind. And they will bid thee hasten on the doom. And Allah faileth not his promise, but lo, a day with Allah is as a thousand years of what ye reckon. And how many a township did I suffer long, though it was sinful? Then I grasped it. Unto me is the return. Say, O mankind, I am only a plain warner unto you. Those who believe and do good works, for them is pardon and a rich provision. While those who strive to thwart our revelations, such are rightful owners of the fire. Never sent we a messenger or a prophet before thee, but when he recited the message, Satan proposed opposition in respect of that which he recited thereof. But Allah abolisheth that which Satan proposeth. Then Allah establisheth his revelations. Allah is knower, wise, that he may make that which the devil proposeth a temptation for those in whose hearts is a disease, and those whose hearts are hardened. Lo, the evildoers are in open schism, and that those who have been given knowledge may know that it is the truth from thy Lord, so that they may believe therein, and their hearts may submit humbly unto him. Lo, Allah verily is guiding those who believe unto a right path. And those who disbelieve will not cease to be in doubt thereof until the hour come upon them unawares, or there come unto them the doom of a disastrous day. The sovereignty on that day will be Allah's. He will judge between them. Then those who believed and did good works will be in gardens of delight while those who disbelieved and denied our revelations, for them will be a shameful doom. Those who fled their homes for the cause of Allah, and then were slain or died, Allah verily will provide for them a good provision. Lo, Allah, He verily is best of all who make provision. Assuredly, He will cause them to enter by an entry that they will love. Lo, Allah verily is knower, indulgent. That is so. And whoso hath retaliated with the like of that which he was made to suffer, and then hath again been wronged, Allah will succor him. Lo, Allah verily is mild, forgiving. That is because Allah maketh the night to pass into the day, and maketh the day to pass into the night, and because Allah is hearer, seer. That is because Allah, he is the true and that whereon they call instead of him, it is the false. And because Allah, he is the high, the great. Seest thou not how Allah sendeth down water from the sky, and then the earth becometh green upon the morrow? Lo, Allah is subtile, aware. Unto him belongeth all that is in the heavens and all that is in the earth. 
Lo, Allah, he verily is the absolute, the owner of praise. Hast thou not seen how Allah hath made all that is in the earth subservient unto you? And the ship runneth upon the sea by his command, and he holdeth back the heavens from falling on the earth, unless by his leave. Lo, Allah is for mankind full of pity, merciful. And he it is who gave you life, then he will cause you to die, and then will give you life again. Lo, man is verily an ingrate. Unto each nation have we given sacred rites, which they are to perform, so let them not dispute with thee of the matter, but summon thou unto thy Lord. Lo, thou indeed followest right guidance. And if they wrangle with thee, say, Allah is best aware of what ye do. Allah will judge between you on the day of resurrection concerning that wherein ye used to differ. Hast thou not known that Allah knoweth all that is in the heaven and the earth? Lo, it is in a record. Lo, that is easy for Allah. And they worship instead of Allah that for which no warrant hath been revealed unto them, and that whereof they have no knowledge. For evil doers there is no helper. And when our revelations are recited unto them, thou knowest the denial in the faces of those who disbelieve. They all but attack those who recite our revelations unto them. Say, shall I proclaim unto you worse than that, the fire? Allah hath promised it for those who disbelieve, a hapless journey's end. O mankind, a similitude is coined, so pay ye heed to it. Lo, those on whom ye call beside Allah will never create a fly, though they combine together for the purpose. And if the fly took something from them, they could not rescue it from him. So weak are both the seeker and the sought. They measure not Allah his rightful measure. Lo, Allah is strong, almighty. Allah chooseth from the angels messengers, and also from mankind. Lo, Allah is hearer, seer. He knoweth all that is before them and all that is behind them, and unto Allah all things are returned. O ye who believe, bow down and prostrate yourselves, and worship your Lord and do good that haply ye may prosper, and strive for Allah with the endeavor which is his right. He hath chosen you, and hath not laid upon you in religion any hardship. The faith of your father Abraham is yours. He hath named you Muslims of old time, and in this scripture, that the messenger may be a witness against you, and that ye may be witnesses against mankind. So establish worship, pay the poor due, and hold fast to Allah. He is your protecting friend, a blessed patron, and a blessed helper.